The loss for Florida signaled the end of a college career for Alfredo Perez. His incredible journey from Cuba to Miami to Gainesville is the focus of this week's Fun Spot on the Spot. Alfredo Perez grew up around the game of tennis. His father was an instructor in Cuba and moved the family to Miami when Alfredo Jr. was 10. Yeah, I remember like the, the last year I was in Cuba, it was just like a, we already knew, so it was like trying to like sell stuff and like try to keep it secret so no one knew and stuff like that. And like, uh, it, was, it was crazy. Did but, you just fly over? Or? Yeah, we flew over. Okay. Yeah. And then you get to America and I read you had to live with your uncle for the first year. Yeah, we, we lived with my uncle for the first year. I mean, it was, it was awesome. They took us home and I, I felt like you know, like nothing has happened. Like obviously, like the the language barrier was a, was a big struggle, but it was Miami, so pretty much everyone speaks Spanish. So. During his first year in the states, a tennis coach named Robert Gomez served as a lifeline for the family. My dad had friends from Cuba that worked here and in, worked in Coral Gables and stuff, and like he would talk to them, and they put my dad and me in contact with Robert Gomez, and we went there and like we told him or what's going on and like we just moved and like we didn't have money and stuff so like he helped helped us with first of all give my dad a job and then I, I was able to train there like uh, expensive cover and stuff like that and like so it's unbelievable experience and like he put me in contact with other people like yeah. because of him I'm, I'm where I am today. How did tennis essentially help you assimilate here in the United States? It just made me something to do you know like make friends from tennis and like travel and like meet new people and like learn stuff and like it would take my mind away from like missing like family at home uh, in Cuba and like friends I, I left behind and stuff like that. All that time around the game eventually led to a scholarship offer to the University of Florida to play for head coach Brian Shelton. He is a fighter and uh, it's in his blood. I mean, we can't take that out of him, and we don't want to. Uh, he's had to learn how to temper it a little bit at times, uh, but uh, he's a guy that uh, when the match is on the line, you want him out there competing because you know that this guy's going to bring it, and he's not going to back down. Perez has been an integral piece of the Gators program and is a two-time All-American. I've grown so much, and I've improved so much. It's just because, like, all the guys, they're always one extra, and, like, the coaches, like, focus on you like improve you know more and more like so when you leave college like if you want like you have a, a chance to like pre-pro and stuff.